Welcome to AA Comics. I'm Aaron Baldwin, and once again, I want to invite you on a journey. A journey where I don't leave my house unless it's absolutely necessary because of specific historic events, which I will not be mentioning by name because I don't want YouTube to take this video down. But in light of said specific events and my desire to contribute to the comic book community, I'll be starting a new series. In that series, I'll be highlighting local shops from across the country. The first shop is Comics, Tunes, and Toys out in Tustin, California, and my guy Mike over on Instagram at The Big To Do. Mike and his shop are running some great promotions right now, so I picked up a healthy stack of single issues, which I'm now going to share with you all. The first series is The Omega Men by Tom King. I got two issues from this run. This is issue six, which is a sweet cover. And this is issue eight. This series is available in trade paperback form. I definitely think it's worth the read. Um, these single issues are actually kind of difficult to find. I've been in a lot of local shops that don't have them. And even online, there aren't that many. So I'm trying to complete this run right now. I have about half the issues. So that's a work in progress. The second group of books I got um, was from the Eisner Award-winning series Vision, Tom King's run. Another mini-series, a great run. I have some of these, but not others, so I picked some more up. This is issue number two. This is issue number three. This is issue number eight. This is issue number nine. This is issue number 10. This is issue number 11. And this is issue 12. I actually have issue number one of this series and one or two others. Um, I just need a couple more to complete it and that'll be done. But it's definitely a run I wanted to complete. And um, the condition of these was great. All these books, um, the Omega Men books, Vision, and the next run of books I'm going to show you were all in very fine to near mint condition. So Mike really sent me out the good stuff. So I appreciate that. And this final run is a run I think a lot of you are familiar with, but it's a good one. Um, this run actually reinvigorated my love for comic books um, and got me really back into the hobby again full force. I started reading it in trade paperback about halfway through. I went back to the beginning, um, but it's Batman New 52 by Snyder and Capullo. Um, great covers, great run. I've got about half the run, and this is about to be the second half, so after this I'll only be missing one or two issues. So this is a healthy stack, but great covers, great covers. So this is number three. Issue number four. Issue number five. Issue number seven. Issue number 10, such a boss cover. Look at that. It's dope. It's really cool. Issue 11. Issue number 12. Issue 15. Issue 16. Issue 19. Issue 22, issue 26, issue 28, got about eight more guys, issue 29, issue 31, which is a dope cover, love this cover, got the city in the background, it's sweet, issue 32, Issue 42, issue 45, issue 46, issue 47, issue 48, and last but not least, annual two, which is dope. Actually, I really like this. It's got the blue and it's a sweet cover. Um, so that's it. 
That's a nice stack of books I got. I got to work on three runs, which is great. I'm almost done with most of them, so that's always a good feeling. Again, huge shout out to Mike, who you can find over on Instagram at The Big To Do. Him and his shop are running a lot of promotions right now, so definitely check them out. Uh, you guys know the deal. You can find me over at Instagram at Double A Comics. That's Double A Comics. Um, and if you appreciated this content and this quick little haul, I would greatly appreciate your support with a like and or subscribe. Uh, you guys have a great day and stay safe out there. Later. I know what you're thinking. Still rocking the tie, hiring? Huh, yeah. Someone's got to show these late night hosts how it's done.